a big hello and welcome to all the planner mums glam mums and all my subscribers so today i'm still going on with the hindu mythology books of my daughter so i have a massive uh, hindu mythology books uh, collection for her not very massive it's a little massive but some of the books recently i've ordered for her which i have already shown in my channel is the shlokas the dashavatar the bhagavad gita for kids the 365 indian mythology so if such books are something you are interested to look at uh, please do follow and have a look i've posted each of them individually so you can go through if you're interested to buy i also have posted the sai baba the divine fakir so these are some of the books which uh, you can if you're interested to buy because we all live abroad and we order through amazon or through any of our friends we don't know what's the content inside right so the best way is if somebody has a flip through i don't read the books because it's not fair to the author but i do flip through so you can see this is a series my mom had gifted my daughter when she was born so it's the om shiva then let's the durga then it is saraswati lakshmi krishna hanuman ganpati bappa and kali so yes this these Yes, so these books we can when we go through it, she even reads. My daughter can read these words already, so we always do that together. But uh, I'll do a quick flip through for these so you can see. So first is the Ganesha. So it starts with Ganesha is the son of Lord Shiva and God is Parvati. Ganesh has one brother, brother Kartik. Kartik. Okay, Ganesh. is the destroyer is the destroyer of obstacles obstacles okay let me so ganesha is the favorite son of parvati ganesha has the head of elephant so it has about ganpati bappa many things and then this is how the book is then about god is kali the same way so these are the illustrations beautifully illustrated kids are inspired it has the face of the god Hanuman ji, when we are having puja of certain god, we put the book in front. It's really fun to read, and it's very short, so five four years can read many of the books, many of the words. My daughter reads it, reads it, and she understands more when you are praying. I really rec uh, recommend, and uh, I would highly tell you guys to. Oh, if you're a Hindu, do tell your kids about God and goddesses. Then, in their life, they will have uh, like you know, faith will build because of that. We all live abroad, so many of the schools and all don't teach about this, and we are don't our our generation ourselves. We don't know so much, you know. So it's good to know about our culture and get that imbibed in our kids. See now she knows owl is the uh, vehicle for goddess Lakshmi ji. For elephant is for the for uh, this mouse is for Ganpati Papa. Goddess Lak and for Lakshmi ji is she sits in a lotus. Yeah, so so on. So it's fun to teach them also. Then you have Saraswati, and then uh, the shloka book is amazing. I have already posted a review on that. this is not paid partnership this is just a way to help the kids uh, families of parents who would like to know if you like this content do subscribe to my channel i do share a lot of book recommendations for children my daughter is 5 but when she was a little younger also and then om shiva and then about shiv ji so it's easy to read and like now the kids can read by themselves also so for younger kids So this is an amazing book for me. I'm going to always keep this series because this is my mom bought for my daughter. Uh, she's no more, but at least this book will be passed on to my grandchildren also someday. Yeah. So this is the series. Thank you so much for taking the time to watch my videos, and uh, please do subscribe to my channel.